we're going to see what energy is coming towards you guys in love for the month of november okay for november what messages are there for libras for the month of november all right guys these are general reads the energy can't go vice versa so this could be your energy or this could be someone energies towards you vice versa it could be someone's energy around you um Take it as it applies, okay? If it does not resonate, make sure you guys check your moon and your rising videos. You may get some um, insight on those videos, okay? All right, guys. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the two of wands, okay? So this is telling me that there's a decision that needs to be made, okay? There's one... Um, one road leading this way and another road leading this way. Two different pathways, okay? Um, feeling like you're at a fork in the road. Like, um, you know, which way should I go, okay? How should I do this? Okay, so I have communication coming possibly out of the blue. Something that you possibly have been waiting on and you, you need to make a decision, okay? I'll get, let me cut the deck. All right, so... First part we have, guys, is the Two of Cups, okay? So this could be in regards to a relationship that you have with someone. Maybe you're trying to decide on whether or not if you want to be with this person, all right? The challenge being you guys' energy is the Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy, okay? Maybe deciding on whether or not if you want or need to cut somebody off as well. Okay, you could be feeling as if this person could possibly be like a player. This could be an on again, off again relationship. Okay, you could be playing around or they could be, you know, kind of like the floater back and forth type. But this to me looks like a temporary on again, off again thing here. Past energy. It looks like you guys have been waiting. Maybe you've been waiting for communication from this person. Okay. And then we have you guys on the lookout. You've been watching this person, okay? You've been keeping an eye on this person or vice versa. But somebody here is doing some watching, okay? I feel like you guys are possibly waiting on communication, okay? And for the future energy, we have the high priestess. Okay, some of you guys could be dealing with a Pisces. But this is very secretive energy, okay? And this is also being intuitive okay this is also losing your sense of discernment this is also you know just using your intuitive gifts to you know figure something out because i feel like you guys are trying to figure someone out or figure something out okay you've been doing your research on this person you've been watching them and you've been waiting for some type of communication like i said this could be a on again off of again thing here Let's see what messages we have in love. What messages does the Lord, the love <laughs> angels have for you guys, okay? How do they feel about Libra? Show me how do they feel about Libra. All right, we have religious factors that jump out. Okay, so this uh, situation, your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Okay, so this person could be like from a different or uh, looks at view and views relationships differently than you. Um, the way they look at relationships and love may be, you know, something that you aren't used to. Okay, they could be, you know, come from a different background. They could just be, you know, something that you're not used to. Okay, what other message? How else do they feel about Libra? All right, we have let your friends help you. See, that's what I'm picking up. I'm picking up that you guys are like getting that advice from a, a female friend or a mother. But I feel like you guys possibly have been expressing um, your feelings to this person or to someone in their family or friend or some something to that nature. I feel like um, you, you know, your guard is up. You're not sure what's going on with this person or what this person is up to. Um, and you're not sure if it's safe for you to let your guard down. But I do feel like there needs to be some type of heart-to-heart -heart conversation because there could possibly be deception in this situation, okay? All right, so I'm going to grab one more card and let's see. How do they feel? How do they feel about Libra? How do they feel about Libra? Oh, 
no, this is just too many cards just wanting to jump out. Okay. They might have too much going on. Okay, it might be too many, you know, too many things going on. Juggling too many, too much things, too many people. Let's see, how do they feel about Libra? All right, we have forgiving and learning. All right, so it looks like they're going to be wanting to give this relationship a chance in the future. Okay, they're going to be coming back around, okay, asking you to trust them and telling you that you could be the one. And they're going to be asking for forgiveness, okay? They're going to be asking for forgiveness. Um, I feel like they're going to be telling you they learned a lesson. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. So they're going to be coming back around, okay? Please give me clarifiers for how they feel about Libra. So, I'm picking up, like, out of the blue, okay, out of the blue, they come around and, like, want to take something here to the next level, okay, even possibly, like, engagement or marriage or something to that type, and it's going to be, like, random out of the blue, it's like they come out of the blue, like, you know what, we need to have this conversation, okay, yeah, see, this person views things, views relationships like they can, you know, kind of play around. That's how they're viewing this, okay? They're viewing is they're being um, very playerish, okay? They're looking at relationships, probably dipping in and dipping out. Their energy is the Knight of Wands energy. Some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But we got most definitely eight of wands so this is communicating with friends getting advice from friends and then forgiving loving less look ace of swords okay so they're going to be communicating with you possibly giving you some type of apology um expressing their truth and how they feel so i am picking up communication is getting ready to come in from this person okay look yeah they're having regrets here okay they're regretting the back and forth the in and out Okay, yeah, they're going to be communicating. For some of you guys, this is a long-distance relationship, okay? Some of you guys could be dealing with a cancer, but this is definitely forward movement, okay? So, progression is getting ready to come in, okay? And I do feel they're going to open up and tell you about what they have going on, okay? But I feel like communication is getting ready to come in, and there's going to be some type of heart-to-heart -heart conversation that you guys are getting ready to have, okay? All right, Libras, if this message resonated, guys, make sure to leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to let me know what's going on down in the comment section below, okay? All right, my loves, until next time. Ciao for now. Moving fast like the shooting star I be my own lane, no movie star If this ain't no act, I can't play a part My aura bright like the moon and stars Moving fast like the shooting star I be my own lane, no movie star If this ain't no act, I can't play a part Dr. Cobb higher I got the heat, I'm on fire The Empress of the Empire Got a love desire.